Ooh. All right, okay. Y'all got five? Security! Not disrespect Security. my gentleman, okay? What's up, people? Welcome to another episode of How to Date, where we have three comedians try to win over the love and a date with our beautiful model, Courtney. So, nearest to me, we have comedian Dan Rue. In the middle, we have Jahan, and furthest from me, we have B. Watts. Yeah. This is How to Date. Let's get started. We know everyone has had at least one bad date they can remember if you've been on a date. So we want to know what not to do if they were to be able to take you on a date. What was your worst date experience? My worst date experience was when this guy took me to Chili. <laughs> <laughs> and um, he ordered baby back ribs. And while he was, you know, ordering his food or whatever, and the food came, he started eating. But the, he was talking with his mouth full, and the food was, like, coming at me. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, so, and then, like, the conversation was super dry. Like, he wasn't a gentleman. He didn't open the door. He didn't, like, pull my chair out. You feel me? I like He was just trying to go eat, basically. Exactly. <laughs> he was just trying to be greedy, eat yeah. his ribs, and spit them on me. So... <laughs> Next round, pickup lines. We can all agree that pickup lines can either make or break if a girl will like you or not. So to give them time to come up with some pickup lines, I'm gonna ask you, what is the worst pickup line a guy has ever said to you? Um, I would say the worst pickup line is when a guy shouts out the color I'm wearing, like, hey yo red, hey yo mine the red, like that. Hey yo neon. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> neon gay. Yeah. I'm not, yeah. Yeah, okay, okay. Mm -hmm. Say love. Say, say love Neon, what's happening? Yeah. You heard me, baby? <laughs> All right, so here's your chance to stay a pickup line to Courtney. Okay. Oh, okay. Uh, do you, uh, yeah. Physical pro, do you know what it is? I got that from my boy. You know what I'm saying? How you doing? I'm good. Let me ask you a question. Do you think you can ever uh, stand a guy like me? What do you mean? Oh, that's why you're sitting down. Mm. Okay. All right, all right. All right. She gonna figure it out later. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. Hey, we cool. ain't never heard that one before. <laughs> he tried. John. <laughs> well, I was the one who started this. <laughs> okay. Can't stop now. Yeah. <laughs> Don't walk back here at home. Can't do that. All right. You ever heard of the movie The Matrix? Mm hmm. Well, I took the red pill instead of the blue and woke up and realized you were the one. What? Mm. Um, mm, bars on them. Wait, 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 wait. It was the other pill. <laughs> <laughs> no, right. it was the blue pill. Yeah, um, no, it was the blue pill. But, yeah, guys. Okay, oh. what? I mixed up the pill, but you get the point. How you doing? I'm good. I'm good. You got a relationship with God? Of course. Good, me too. Because you everything I've been praying for. Mm. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Oh, hallelujah. Amen, Amen brother. He brought the church into Amen. it. Amen. Oh, my All right, God. so that was pretty rough around, but who do you feel had the best for your mind? It was fun. Um, I'm going to go with Jahan. Because, of course, she knows him personally. No, <laughs> no. Because I, the wrong I just mixed the, up I've seen I them mixed together. Up the pill. I've seen them together in the I past, mixed up the pill. Like, <laughs> Second round, Q&A. We all know that when you're in a date, you need to have questions and answers. So Courtney will ask the guys some questions. Let's go, Courtney. Oh, all right. <laughs> Keep going. Who talking? Girl. <laughs> Who talking when I'm talking? Uh, you just ma'am. You yes, ain't say nothing yet. So okay. Hey, no. Okay. Yes, ma'am. Go ahead, Mark. Dan Rue. Oh, my God. I accidentally fart in public. <laughs> what do you do? <sighs> I say, like, I whisper in your ass, I say, baby, baby, you know, you know, you, you know, you just, yeah. So we're going to walk over here and act like we ain't smell nothing. <laughs> I need you to come over here with me to this open area and ask, let's start to talk, like, you know, so nobody knows what's really going on. But come over here and step with me. Step you with supposed me. to act like you farted. Like you did it. That's what you, you supposed to do. You know what's crazy? Excuse me, like it was you, bro. Exactly. The woman <laughs> always <laughs> try to put it on the man. <laughs> <laughs> Jahan, <clears throat> what odd talent do you have? Mm. That's my question. 
odd talent do I have? <laughs> ask me the good question. <sighs> what odd talent do I have? Um, odd talent. <laughs> I have. Ah, that's great. That's great. I have the talent of awkwardness when I don't know how to think of an odd talent. That yeah. I have. Okay. <laughs> That's good. Worth a try. That's good. I try. That's it. I just B Watts, I ask you for a massage after you had a long day of work. What do you do? Give you that massage. It's simple. No matter what I've been through, my job is to please you. Mm. See, you know, I think you a player. Uh, you sound like a little player over you here. Because <laughs> I'm telling you what you want to hear. Mm hmm But it's the truth. Mm -hmm. uh. <laughs> Here we go with the third round, Let Her Laugh. This round is all about the guys trying to make you laugh. So they will each have 30 seconds to try to make you laugh. Let's start off with Dan. First off, you know, we still, I just want to tell you, you're so fun today, <laughs> girl. So what's up, though? Real talk, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to ask you a personal <laughs> question. <laughs> Can I ask you a personal question? What? Mm -hmm. I made her laugh, so I will be. <laughs> I ain't got to do myself. But honey, your nail, that why? <laughs> mm. You come to me, I fit for you forever, darling. You'll never have the problem, okay? Whatever you like to do for you. He uses that one a lot already. Really? I'm sorry. <laughs> he does that often. Yeah. What I do? Mm. Oh. That's amazing. No, I just did that. That's the first time? That's, a, that's the second time. That's All the right. second time. John, go. Yeah, but I All right, know. I'm here to make you laugh. I'm here to make you laugh. Oh, that ain't gonna make her laugh. Look at me. <laughs> there you go. That's <laughs> all you gotta do. You gotta focus what? on what you want. What? No words. The power of making laugh with no words. Uh, play it back on the play. Oh my god. <laughs> that. Be what? All right, okay. Y'all got five? This is the truth. We'll see. Can you picture Jahan naked? Wow. No, <laughs> wow. How you gonna flip? She's trying not to try to She's trying, she's like, mm. No. That would be a fun. So, you like to dance? Mm hmm. Get out by Queen. Why? Get out by Queen. You can't be stopping you. Time. Get up. No, it ain't time. She wanna get up. Oh, Lord. Oh. All that ass off that seat like that. <laughs> What's the time, Tatiana? What's the time? Y'all let him go for 40 seconds. Timing, bro. All right. You can't be still in lines. You want to know what he's still? He's still one? Wow. I see what happened here. <laughs> they try to flip oh, it on you. Oh, it's a it's even double winning. team. Call me hey, MJ. No, it's not. Call me LeBron because hey, hey. they trying to double team. <laughs> Thank you guys for those laughs, and now we are going to make a decision. One of the comedians will be going home, and two will have the chance to stay and win a date. Before we get into that round, make sure you guys check out the Dilemma Round. A good kisser or a smooth talker? Good kisser. Would you rather marry a guy who loves your family or a guy who loves your friends? Family. A guy who makes a ton of money being a stripper or makes average money being an Uber driver? Uber driver. A guy who's fully covered in tattoos or covered with hair? Tattoos. Would you rather be married to someone extremely attractive or be extremely attractive yourself? Myself. Have three flavored condoms fall out of your wallet on a first date or knock your entire drink into your date's lap? Drink into his lap. Would you let your partner have sex with someone else for $1 million? Yes. Would you rather be told you're not good at kissing or not good at oral? Not good at kissing. <laughs> a guy who farts or burps a lot? Ugh, um, burps. Short guy with big dick or tall guy with small dick? Short, tall with, tall with small. That's many. <laughs> and welcome back. So I asked you those questions and one stood out to me. I asked you, would you let your partner have sex with someone else for $1 million and you said yes? Why? What would you, what would you buy with that $1 million? I will probably invest in some property. Mm, what if y'all were married? Mm. For that meal, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah. It's good. As long as he's using a condom, we good. Uh, who do you guys think is going home? Dan. Um, 
you. <laughs> John. Hey, man, it's all up to court. You know what I'm saying? I like Nobody's that, Jahan. Control. I like that. Be Watts. Yeah, uh... <laughs> I don't know, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> all right. <laughs> Tough decision, right? Actually, it's the easy one. <laughs> <laughs> Who are you sending home? So I'm going to send home the male gigolo, uh, the player of the group. Uh, be watch. When, when women say they want an honest man, be they watched. can't handle it. Be watch. I'm just trying to give it what she wants. The, the, the player. He's yeah. used to the roses. Go You're dismissed. Rose. How do I <laughs> I'm going to witness to your best friend. Oh, we can't, record. we can't do that. Can't do that. Oh, we can't. Can't do that. Copyright. Can't copyright it. <laughs> this is also... A comedy show, a comedy <laughs> dating show. So we're having a good time, guys. Al, we get a round of applause for everybody. <laughs> Jerry, man, you did a great job back there. Sound guy, sound guy, how you doing? How you, how you sound guy? You, do, you good? So why did you choose for B Watts to go home? Well, you know what? All of B Watts' answers, it just seems like he he's told a bunch of women those lines. What you wanted to plenty hear. of times, you know. And he just seems like a player. He seems like he just want to take you home and. Mm get in your pants and huh. I'm not really interested in that you there know you go. so we had to get him out of here that's a motherfucking <laughs> lie that's a fucking lie okay I'm honest we had to get him I just want to tell here. her the truth Excuse and if me. you know what I'm saying if she want to do lesser oh lesser that's her that ain't a word hey security oh, not disrespect huh? my gentleman okay yeah, do not disrespect you need to go home you need to go nah. home you know I will I you will are <laughs> and I'm gonna DM her best friend <laughs> Welcome to the grand finale, The Spark. Both of our comedians have shock collars connected to their wrists, and Courtney has the power to shock them if they get the answer wrong. Let's go. What was the location of Courtney's worst date experience? Chili's. Ooh. What did Courtney's date order? Ribs. Mm. What did the date of Courtney do that Courtney did not like? Spit food on her. No, we did not spit food she on her. He was eating the ribs. He was eating the ribs. He was eating the ribs. Let me finish. <laughs> he was eating the ribs, no. and, and, and he was being obnoxious. He said spit food about him. And, he, and he was, while he was talking, yeah. it was spitting on his yeah. I just spitting gave the answer. See, the, who's wrong? the thing is, no, no. I said who's wrong, he was Courtney? talking with his mouth open. Jahan's right. Thank you. Jahan right. You got to let me, when someone speaks, you got to let them finish. What would Courtney buy with $1 million? Real estate. Mm. <laughs> Why did Courtney send B-Watts home? Because he's a player. Was, what kind of pickup lines doesn't she like? Hey, the color. Hey, color. Courtney huh? ones. No, that wasn't color. I was right. Yeah, you I was still right. got stung was because right. I was right. So, wait, wait, wait. wait. I was right. Wait, 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 wait. like, hey, yo, neon. Can, can we stop? <laughs> can we right. stop for a second? But I got shocked, okay. though, when I was right. Okay. In my defense, okay. if we were in a courthouse, okay. ruling is, what was the question? Say it again. Exactly like you did before. And what kind of pickup lines doesn't she like? What kind of pick you don't like corny ones, do you? But that was it. No, 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 no. You asked, you asked exactly what kind of pick up doesn't she like. That she, she stated. You didn't you didn't, you didn't say, say that. That's what not, is she but it's say obviously that what she, she stated. Like. Exactly. So but, therefore, but still I got the shock and I I explained everything that she said. <laughs> Alright, Courtney, close your eyes for me. What color are Courtney's eyes? Brown. Hazel. <laughs> They're hazel. Hazel. Brown. <laughs> She's black. <laughs> That's rare. Like, I know you, black people with hazel eyes. Yeah, but it's yeah. not My like common. Like, Damn, you be a racist yeah. now? Yeah. Don't try to make this a race thing. Don't you do that, Dan. <laughs> I'm All white. Right. My eyes Don't. are brown. So now, what does that mean? Now, each of our contestants will okay. have a chance to ask her on a date. Go ahead, Jahan. No, let Dan go first since he's so no, talking. Okay. Come on, Jahan. I want you to go first. Ooh. Okay. She know what she won't. All right. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. <clears throat> first of all, let me just make this clear. I am not a player. Let's just get that right, okay? Okay. All right. People may have reacted to me in the past because of my personality, mm -hmm. all right? I cannot fight that. What I can say is okay. that you, it's not just about the beauty, it's about you, mm -hmm. all right? Got this little Leah thing going on. I, I'm getting distracted. But I would be honored to spend some time with the real woman. Okay. A woman that's, that knows the BS is not going to let somebody who's trying to throw out all these lines to facade her, okay? A real woman like yourself is like a Michelle Obama. Okay. 
Okay. That's like that's like what Obama had. I want someone like you, because Obama would never be Obama without Michelle. All right, yeah. Dan. The thing is, I can't promise you rag like riches and stuff like that, but I know for a fact uh, that I would give you me. And that's something that's hard to find because I was raised with women in my house, my sisters and my mom, and I know how to respect and treat women with the right and dignity. And also, listening to you talking about real estate and stuff, you seem like you got a good head on your shoulders and you seem like you know what you want. And I'm a hardworking man. And to me to have a woman like you is like no other. Can't put a name on it. You know what I'm saying? Because you're not a Michelle Obama. There's something beyond that. Mm. Oh, wow. And uh, that's something that, that's something that, <laughs> y'all chill. That's something that I'd like to work on. Something more than a name, you know. Okay. To put something it's not about right. being a name. It's not about, it's not about Jahan. being a name. Jahan, <laughs> you've had your chance, All right. Jahan. Courtney. You've had it. But it is the time. Can I finish? Oh, oh yeah. so he, he still that? gets more time? I, I didn't. I, I mean, didn't I'm not was... done. Come on. After all said and done. I would really, really love to take you out and uh, do whatever you want to do. Your favorite restaurant, Ruth Chris, we can do something like that. Cool. Mm. All right, Courtney, now it is time to make your decision. Who will you go on a date with and who will you be sending home? I will be going on a date with Dan Ruth. Oh. <laughs> 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 The producers ruined it. <laughs> Sorry, they planted seeds in her head. <laughs> planted seeds in her head. Give me my rose. Oh, here you go, man. I'm sorry, man. Sorry, we'll Dan. see you next time. I still love you, Corey. Ooh. <laughs> I want a date. Get out of here. Bye. Uh, oh, that's so sweet. That's so sweet. Make sure to comment, like, and subscribe. Thank you guys for watching. And make sure, again, if you know whatever Bible verse that he said, make sure you comment that down below. My name is Ronnie Bass, and this is How to Date. See you guys next time. The producers hated on your boy. Oh.